hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Raise your voice and shout hallelujah. hallelujah. To the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, hallelujah. hallelujah. To the maker of heaven, and the earth. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. He deserves all the praise, all the honor, and all adoration. Shout hallelujah. hallelujah. The Bible says unto the Lord, shall the gathering of his people be. I believe in, in heaven. The 24 elders are gathered this morning. Is a culture in heaven that they gather to worship God. Yes. The innumerable company of angels, they gather to worship the Lord. And we the sons of men, we cannot be an exception. So wherever you are seated or standing or watching through the live stream or under the sound of my voice, whether you are in your room, whether you are in your bedroom, in your sitting room, wherever you find yourself in the office, in the car, lift your voice and lift your spirit your hands are not busy lift your hands and begin to worship him declare his glory declare his anointed declare his presence just connect to God's presence this morning as we worship him in spirit and in truth only him deserves our worship oh we worship you Jesus Lord we worship you this morning Lord we worship you from the depth of my heart, I worship. Set my spirit free to worship. Somebody wave your hands to Jesus. You deserve all the praise of the Lord. Nobody like you, Jesus. Nobody like you, Lord. Somebody like you, Jesus. Somebody give him glory. Nobody like you, Jesus. I raise my voice in worship this morning. I raise my heart in worship this morning. My spirit is in tune with you this morning. I raise my hands in worship. You alone, you alone, you alone deserve all the glory. Let your praise and spirit is at most fair. Sweet spirit of grace, set my spirit free to worship you this morning. Jesus, we bow before you. Jesus, we worship. We raise our voice. We raise our hands. We lift our song. Yeah. Oh, we worship. You deserve it. We bless your majesty. Name is open for you, reign magnificent heroes, victorious. Your power is shown throughout the earth, and we explain our God is mighty. Lift up your name, that you are holy, sing it again, all honor and glory, in adoration, we bow before the throne, we declare. Oh, that's it. 
come on you know something that is something that happens whenever anybody walks into the presence of a king or whenever you want to see a royalty and you step into the palace of the king there's an approach there's an attitude to see the king and as a matter of fact in some instances the audience could be waiting for the king but the king will not come out until there is a sound until the praiser the one that has the instrument begins to play and then when the when the praises when the atmosphere is charged and then the, the tempo of the of, of, of the praises goes high then it is time for the king to step out and step in in his royalty and in his majesty and this is what is going to happen this morning as you praise the lord you your praises will stir god your praises should stir god to rise from his throne to step into this atmosphere to inhabit the praises of his people can i get a witness in this house how many of us know that god is good god has been good to you and you can declare it. The psalmist said, with my mouth will I make known thy faithfulness to all generations. So I don't care what has been my experience before now. But I stand in this position of praise to break forth my hallelujah to him. If you can join me in this, lift your hands and worship. Hallelujah. hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. We are saying, God, arise and take your place. Shout it, arise, arise. and take your place. One more time, arise and take your place. Put your hands together.
Hallelujah. Some of us are still yet to stand the revelation of the goodness of God. And now my prayer is that this morning that God will open your eyes to see the mightiness. How mighty the works of his hands are. He that made the firmament without any pillar sustaining it. The Bible said that his path, his footpath is in the is in the platform of oceans. He that rides upon the chariot of the cloud with no connection. He that spoke and no one can reverse his words. His words are yes and amen. This is the God we are praising this morning. And I bet you, if you can get the right attitude to worship him this morning, you will see how great he is. All we need to see is how great he is. All we need to see is how great he is.
to see the glory of the Lord give him worship don't just be an spectator in this section this morning Bible says in Revelation he is worthy to receive glory, honor, power and praise for he has created all things all things for his pleasure so let your attendance let your presence give him pleasure let the praises and the worship that comes from your lips give him pleasure. If you want to see the Shekinah glory, you have to praise the source of the glory. You have to appease the source of glory so that his glory will come. Feel his presence. Lift your hands and feel his presence this morning. Hallelujah.
of your breath can't get enough of your fire I can't get en- can't get enough I can't get enough of your power I can't get enough of your presence I can't get enough of your fire I can't get enough can how many of us need it I can't get enough of your fire I can't get enough of your fire I can't get enough of your fire. I can't get enough, can't get enough. Say that. Can't get enough of your fire. Can't get enough of your fire. Can't get enough of your fire. I can't get enough of your fire. Release the fullness of your spirit. Hold back your worship from me. I am limitless when I stand before your presence. And I vow to you, Lord, that I will always worship your majesty in all situations. Somebody raise your hand and worship.
This is my worship. This is my worship. You deserve it, Jesus. 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 Somebody call the name of Jesus. You deserve it, Jesus. when I get the opportunity to come into the house of the Lord to worship him in the beauty of his holiness and to fellowship one with the other to fellowship with the saints of God so I thank you this morning you may take your seats just for a moment if you want to keep standing that's fine we're still in the attitude of worship 
I just want to pause for a quick moment to speak to our occasion today. Today is the, or the celebration of Living Words anniversary, and we are very excited. I know you're all excited when it's your birthday. Some people take, you don't see them when it's their birthday because they're gone. It's their birthday. They take the whole month to celebrate their birthday. This is Living Words birthday, okay? We're celebrating, that's why it's called an anniversary celebration. And there's so much happening at Living Word. God has blessed us with this beautiful property and we are so grateful, so grateful, so grateful to him that it, everything is happening within the season of our anniversary. And so I want to extend a special, special, special welcome to all our members and friends of Living Word Christian Center International Ministries. I want to extend welcome to those that are linked in through internet and if you're there please go ahead and type your name to say who you are so we can respond with thank you for joining us because i can't see you i can't hear you i can't touch you but if you respond in the chat somebody will respond back to you we love you and we are so grateful for the contributions you've made in the past and that you continue to make to this ministry your gifts are noticed amen and god knows the most important person to notice your gift is god it's not the pastors it's not the leaders but it's god because he he recognizes the sacrifice you made okay when the widow came in to give her offering there were a lot of people wealthy people in the church and they gave a lot of money but God noticed her sacrifice because she gave all she had. As small as it was, it was all she had. And her gift was noticed even above theirs because guess what? It was documented in the Bible. Amen? So it is, it is awesome that God recognized all of you. So thank you so much for tuning in. I want to recognize the pastors, the leaders, the angels of this house, or pastors, pastors Oral Walters and pastors Sandra Walters. Thank God for them, for strengthening them and keeping them. Amen. God bless you both. They look awesome, amazing. They're not aging. That means we aren't giving them that much trouble. God bless you. God bless our elders, our leaders, the board members, everyone in your respective places. Um, God bless you. Thank you so much for all that you do to keep this ministry going, to keep the lights on. God bless you. God bless you all. And our celebration doesn't end this morning. It continues this evening at 5 p.m. So I encourage you all to come out, invite your friends. It's a safe environment. So come on out and let's worship and celebrate God together. Is there anyone here visiting for the very first time? Just lift your hand so we can acknowledge you. God bless you. There are two in the back. God bless you. We love you. Thank you so much for joining. And I hope that your experience here today will be like none other that God will reveal to you why you're here and that the word will transform and heal whatever it is that that you may be faced with but please feel free to worship god it doesn't matter where we're a very open church we're open to what god is doing and what the holy spirit would have us to do and so allow the holy spirit to minister to you today and just keep your hearts open to what god has to say amen do you feel welcome well we're going to do something a little different we haven't done it in a long time and you know, we are, we're in this very, they would say in Jamaica, stush church, stush, <laughs> right? Um, we're in Thanksgiving, amen? Amen, we're gonna do this old song. I've got so much to give him thanks for. You wanna do that? I'm not gonna ask you to go around because everybody's keeping safe distance and don't, don't breathe too hard on anyone. Keep your mask on. If that makes you comfortable, that is totally fine. No one is going to get offended. But I want us to celebrate, okay? All right, so it's going to require for you to stand to your feet just for a quick moment. We're going to give God some thanks. I've got so much, 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 so much to thank Him for. I've got so much, 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 so much to thank him for. I've got my pastors to thank him for. I've got my pastors to thank him for. I've got my pastors to thank him for. So much, 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 so much. 
As we continue in celebration, the choir, the choir, the praise team is going to minister to you one more time. And immediately after the choir, we're going to welcome the host, the, the pastor of this house, our own pastor, Walters. I'm going to ask you to stand and receive him in the presence of the Lord. Many of us remember Psalm 23. Echo it with me. The Lord is my shepherd. Shout it with me. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. You can finish it later, but lift your hands and wave it to Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Lord. goes before me. He goes before me. Defender behind me. Defender behind me. I won't fear. I won't fear. I'm filled with the anointing. Filled with anointing. My cup overflowing. My cup's overflowing. Hallelujah. No weapon can harm me. No weapon can harm me. No more fear. I won't fear. Hey, people of God, say hallelujah. He's close. 
So I will walk in your peace. So I will walk in your peace. Somebody, God's spirit is within And it's your victory. It's your guarantee. Your spirit. Your spirit lives within
Hallelujah.